This is from Sharon Strawberry. Gretchen, I find myself often frustrated by the fact that I'm not doing what I want to do. I work all day and I don't have time to pursue my talents anymore. What do you suggest I do? I have to pay the bills, but I have this fear that I'm going to end up never following my dreams. I think one thing to think about is that we tend to overestimate what we can do in a short term, like in an afternoon, and we underestimate what we can do over the long term if we do a little bit consistently. And so let's say you have a creative project that you want to work on. One thing you might think about is getting up an hour earlier in the morning when everything is quiet and working on that. Now, probably you would have to go to sleep earlier, but what I find from talking to people is that the end of the day for most people is very pleasant. So it's hard to turn off the light and give up that time. But on the other hand, it's a low value kind of pleasure. Pleasure. It's like watching television, you know, chatting, you know, like I call my sister on the West Coast, re cat reading the paper. It's sort of pleasant time, right. but it's not a high value happiness right. time. But trying to set aside sort of a consistent, manageable amount of time so that you feel like there is a place for it, so you don't have that haunted feeling.